Good morning, Coronation. Welcome to day 40. Andrew, how you doing? Check out my new shirt. Oh yeah. Representing City Station, all of its awesome groups. Hey, it's super rainy today, and uh, I was trying to do something different. So right now, Andrew, I am making a game. I'm creating it. My goal is to absolutely stump you. So I wonder, it got me thinking, is this game gonna be like a game that you get not right? Zero, and I'm completely successful? Or am I creating a game that you might actually win? That was a scary thought. Anyway, uh, that's what I'm up to this morning. What are you doing? Good morning, Corey and Coronacation. What do you think, boys? Y'all got anything to say? Uh, hey, Coronacation! Yeah. Hey. So, you asked what we're doing. So, we've done some work. I've done some work, made some phone calls. Um, I got to talk with Nicole and Trey this morning. So that was cool. Um, the boys have been working on their homework. Um, working on reading and writing and stuff. Uh, we had pancakes for breakfast. I made some uh, fun fatty pancakes. Yeah. And they were good! After that, we were curious about how they make maple syrup. And so we watched a few videos. Two videos. We watched two videos on how they make maple syrup, which is pretty cool. Um, but uh, that's what we've been up to, Corey. Hey, guys. Communication. If y'all know, yesterday it was Earth Day. It was Earth Day yesterday, but today's a new day, right? Yeah. Um. So. And it's gonna be fun. Yeah, it is gonna be fun, even though it's raining. But Corey has a game for me to play, and I imagine he's got a game for y'all to play. I'm curious to see. He he said he he made it, probably to stump me. Do you think you'll be better than me? Yeah. Yeah. Of course, everybody's better than me at these games. Well, anyway, Corey, that's what we're up to. I'm excited to play your game. Kind of excited. I don't know. I'm excited to play games. I like playing games even when I lose. Because I like playing. I just, I like playing. I like having fun. So yeah, uh, Corey, what, what's the game, huh? Andrew, I'm excited to tell you all about it. But before we do that, we need to see our memory verse of the month. Samuel, turning it over to you. Hey guys, what is up? We are still hanging out on Coronacation. I hope you guys are having an awesome day time i hope school's going good or whatever you guys are doing at this point you're having fun but today i got tasked with reminding you of the bible verse so first we're going to go over it and then we'll do the motions okay so first don't do anything only to get ahead don't do it because you are proud instead be humble value others more than yourself that's philippians chapter 2 verse 3 nerve you got it now Corey asked me if i could do the motions and i thought I could do the motions, or we could learn some new motions. So, I've been practicing hard on these. These are the best motions I think anyone has ever made for a Bible verse. Are you ready? So we're gonna start with don't, all right? And let me just bring your arms as wide as you can. Don't do anything. Only, you ready for this? Don't do anything, only to get ahead right because no one wants a head i already have a head i don't need two heads so don't do anything only to get a head right you got it and then the next don't you have to jump really high because that's the coolest part right and then swing your arms don't do it because you're proud strike a poke proud right like whatever you proud hands on those hips you're like a superhero proud right so Start from the top. Don't do anything only to get ahead because we don't need one, we already have one. Don't do it because you're proud. Instead, be humble. Right? Get on your Show how humble you are. That's what we need. We need be humble, right? Right? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. So, don't do anything only to get ahead don't do it because you're proud instead be humble now are you guys ready let's first take the line out of you this is going to be the coolest move okay you ready i figured out how to oh just got a text oh what oh i sh i should have thought well that's awkward scratch that we're uh we're not i guess we're not doing my motions so 
Let's just stick with the classic ones, okay? Don't do anything only to get ahead. Don't do it because you're proud. Instead, be humble. Value others more than yourselves. Philippians 2, 3. You know what? That was a little bit easier. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Spanish magician says that he will disappear on the count of three. Uno, dos, poof, and he disappeared without a chance. I wanted to remember everything I did as a lumberjack, so I kept a log. What kind of tiles can you not stick on walls? Reptiles. All right, Andrew, I'm ready to play. This game is called Name That Sound Animal Edition. And so I found some crazy animals making some crazy noises and you need to decide which animal is making the sound. I'll make it even a little bit easier for you. I'll give you three options. So you just listen to the sound clip, guess within 10 seconds what animal it is. We're gonna see if you can be right. There are eight, count them, eight possible videos that you can get eight points on, but I bet the kids will do better than you. So here we go, keep score. Let's see if you can beat Andrew. Name that sound, animal edition. <laughs> what is that? A koala bear saying hello, a pig defending his food, a kangaroo wanting to fight. Two, I'm going two. A pig defending his food. That. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness, that was weird. I'll probably get none of these right. A chipmunk eating a nut, a cat watching a bird, a sloth take, talking to a friend. One. I think it's one. A chipmunk eating a nut. This is weird. These are weird noises. Okay. A bear. A fierce lion growling, an old camel groaning, a hungry grizzly bear roaring. I'm going with my gut. Three, a hungry grizzly bear roaring. Jeez, oh, Corey. Coronacation, I hope y'all are doing better. I have not gotten a single one right yet. Okay, here we go. What in the world is that? Ostrich looking for a friend, a rhino falling asleep, a humpback whale greeting a kayaker. Two, two, a rhino falling asleep. I am the worst. some weird noises yeah I've gotten zero right coyotes attacking a, a porcupine cheetah cubs wrestling for fun raccoons fighting in a tree raccoons fighting in a tree three raccoons fighting in a tree come on yes Finally, I've gotten one right. One. Oh. Squirrel? A squirrel. Warning, predators are near. I'm going with one. I'm not even reading the other ones. That sounds like a squirrel. Boom! It's from my deer hunting days. I've heard that many times. I knew that sound. I've heard that many times in the woods. We got any more? Is that it? What is that? Mm, one. Prairie dogs barking. I hope it's not a deer after that one. Oh my gosh. 
That didn't sound like a deer. That, I've never heard that. Not that way. I've heard him blow, but I've never heard him yell like that. That was weird. A three, a porcupine. I have no idea. I almost went with two. I am so bad. I am so bad at this game. I have gotten one right. One. That was it, y'all. One. And the one that was the deer, I feel like I should have gotten the... Ugh. I hope y'all did better than me. I really hope that you did better than me. I'll see you guys later. Bye.